Oh, poops. Looks like I'm about to get soaked. Out on the beach and dig a few worms. I'll just show you that in a minute. I'm not going to show you the digging of the worms as well. You know, that's just dull, isn't it? Anyway, I had to shave, but uh, stated didn't work. So uh, I've come down to get a few, get a few worms. And uh, it's good low water, it's a big, big tide tonight. So anyway, that's what I'm going to do. I thought I'd do a quick intro. And then uh, dig a few worms and see what we get. <laughs> see you in a bit. <laughs> Cast the two. Some are starting to set over there. One rod. Stages in work, so snuck out. <laughs> anyway, right, I'm going to set up, get cast out, and maybe dig one or two. Bait in the water. Fresh lugworm, pulley panel, size 2 I think. Can't remember. Anyway, you know what a pulley panel is. Done quite a few worms though, as you've just seen. Did them all in this little area here. <laughs> Turn around and walk very far. Hoping now. I'm having to hold my phone because, well, I forgot my GoPro. So I'll do it on my iPhone. Although I haven't filmed on this one, it was uh, a new phone. The number 11. Oof, really flash these days. Anyway. So, yeah, we're in the water. Traps are set. Hoping for a flounder, maybe an early bass. <laughs> or a fish. <laughs> we're hoping for a fish. And I hope it doesn't absolutely hoof it down. Because it has been most of the day. I wasn't even going to come. And, uh yeah, the weather's been absolutely shocking today. Blowing an absolute howl earlier on. But it seems to have stopped now. Wind uh, southwesterly, so it's pretty much behind me anyway. But uh, yeah, so there you go. This flaggy thing out my pocket. Oh, and drop it in the sand. Did the hole in this cod father. <laughs> <laughs> drop me vapor in the sand. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't going to do anything today. Oh, well, it well, wasn't going to fish. Um, because of the weather. The plan was to come and have a go, like, but with all that shocking, shocking wind and rain we've had all day. Some diggers out there. Yeah, I wasn't going to bother. A few people's digging when it rains out there, or. He's one of them two up there. But anyway. Irrelevant. Right, let's zoom it back out. Still trying to figure this frigging phone out. It should be low water about now. But, uh, what's that thing doing over there? Get over here. There you go. That's it. Yeah, so I've just been pumping a few worms along here. Only, uh, this is quite a small area, not quite a lot. Must have got 30, about 30, I reckon. I only wanted a few for tonight. Uh, well, I'm not going tomorrow. I'm not fishing tomorrow. Uh, we're just going to pictures. I haven't been to pictures for years. I'm going to go see the John Wick 4. That'll be interesting. Although the likelihood is I'd have already been to see that before you see this so let me tell you now it was pretty good <laughs> yeah so uh, Stacey's birthday on Saturday so we're going to go to the pictures tomorrow night so no fishing which is off at the weekend so if we've got a decent tide I shall keep the worms 
we shall fish at the weekend. That's, I'm not used to not having a tripod. Anyway, we shall see if we catch anything. Ah, oh, starting to rain. Oh, so it'll either be pneumonia or a whiting. <laughs> some sort of starfish no idea what it is you'll have to go to uh, the fish locker or smash fishing <laughs> if you want to know what they are oh, it's, it's alive he's having a he's wagging his tail so he must be happy right in the water park there's quite a few of them things knocking about I don't know what they are some sort of starfish I assume <coughs> they do new I have seen them actually on uh, some of the channels. Got a few more worms. <laughs> That'll definitely keep me going because, well, I'm still on the first one. Out of touch, so. Pretty much sure I'm not gonna. Anyway, diggers are still out down there, mind you, they will be. Stay out as long as possible. Look at this. It's like the front line of World War One. <laughs> Where the sandbanks go when you get a big tide like this, the sandbanks go right out. It's about a, no, a minus 0 0.4 or something tied tonight. It's a pretty big one. <laughs> it's going to come in like hell. <laughs> I'll probably bring half a ton of weed in with it. But anyway, we're out, we're fishing. We're in the wind. It's getting up a little bit now. Although it hasn't gone cold yet, so I'm gonna have to put my coat back on. That gull just missed me line then. Anyway. I'll either stand here doing nothing, or I shall dig a few more worms. I don't know. I don't even need any more worms, so I don't, shouldn't really dig anymore. Probably won't bother digging anymore. So I'll so stand here looking at a motionless rod tip as usual. <laughs> God, I'll crack my screen protector again. Looks like. Anyway, I'll talk about travel light tonight. Rod, bucket with a couple of weights in, a couple of rigs in. Rod rest and a pump. No need, nothing. I'm not, uh, not really seriously fishing, so. Well, I am, I suppose. I've got a bait on, on a rig. It's cast out into the water, and that's where the fish live, allegedly. got here the tide was on this dry line there the tide was up to there and it's dropped further back again I'm quite far from, <laughs> Rod's quite far from the water at the moment I'm gonna get some dickhead come running through the line in a minute time jogging on here I'm allowed to you know what they're like you know what they're like if you're beach fishing <laughs> anyway I'm going to stop waffling <laughs> because oh well, it's five past seven the tide has turned and it is coming in this is the flood I haven't got darkness happened Ooh. still no bites although I I haven't cast back out again yet. So I will do in a minute. 
I shall uh, reel in, shove a new bait on. Got about 50 or 60 worms, I carried on digging a few. So, uh, more than enough worms to be getting on with. Not had a touch on that yet, but uh, well, now it's starting to flood. Usually we get we'll get something. We do a little dab or a whiting. But anyway, we shall see. I moved the uh, pump and the bait bucket further up the beach. And, uh, still quite warm actually, considering it's been a right crappy weather all day. It's not too bad. The wind dropped. Forecast to drop. So at least the forecast was right for once. <laughs> anyway, I shall reel this in, get a little bait on it, and goof it out. And, uh, get up the beach there and wait for it to come in. Keep an eye out as uh, just see that. Out a couple of times. <laughs> I'm not up, baby. <laughs> right. Well, it's not a blank. <laughs> Tiny little boy. He was on with a reel in. I'll unhook him. Get that fresh bait on him. Got a little bite on him. It's a little tickle. I'll do now put a kettle cock of camera on. It's stopped. <coughs> Let's go to the other side. That'll do it. Ball coming up with the channels. <laughs> Shout out a surfer. Sandbank. Oh, the hell's that flowing in? It's exciting. Lots of worms. I did have a bite. I mean, I did. I did. It did. It did. It Well, another little bite. <laughs> Bigger than the last one. <laughs> Proper sucked both of them up and down over the pig. Anyway, should get him all up and then put back. Really carefully, this channel fills in quite quick. There's another one behind me there now, but there's a bit of a rise up to it. So, anyway, enough shite. And this little tingling back in the water. Oh, 
10 past 8 two waiting that's about it I didn't even, didn't even see the bikes the only bite I saw was nothing on it nothing on it when I brought it in the worm had been absolutely mothered like that <coughs> yeah I didn't see that last bite all the well the first bite and I didn't see the first bite either so not a blank. Got about an hour left, I suppose. And uh, we'll pick up Mrs. Woman from work. Tide's running in now, really. Really fast. Comes in another channel here. I'm gonna watch now. Well, it's not too bad, they don't get very deep, it takes a bit of time to fill up. There's a bit of a deep hole there, you don't want to be getting uh, stuck in. Um, it will be a bit too early for them really maybe, I don't know. I don't, I've caught bass here in March before. So, anyway, oh, I can see a bit of wetness falling out of the sky. Oh no! <laughs> Might not be here over out of it. <laughs> not a pretty sure if we get anything else it'll be another whiting. little tingling. Yeah, she's going back. <laughs> Getting back in the drink. There you go. <laughs> Slam off. <laughs> Tide's getting close again now. She runs up. Once it gets up the bank a bit, it uh, runs up so far. Move my stuff back to the other side of this channel. And have one more cast, I reckon. Before I uh, make like a tree and leave. second bite I've seen <laughs> have a shoulder bend it in and have a look let's have a look me dog oh 
Right, peeps. Back in the car. Didn't do an intro on the beach. I was busy legging it. Turned out a bit of a white infest. I had, um, I had a few more that I didn't bother filming. But, um, well, this one on the last cast then as well. I did have a cracking bite at one point. I was busy looking at uh, some bloody video my brother had sent. And I looked round and the rod just slammed over, hooped over. Well, by the time I shoved my phone back in my pocket and hit it, it had gone. So, don't know what it was. Could have been a bass. Could have been another coddling. Could have been an over-enthusiastic over whiting, probably. But or even a decent flounder. Who knows? You never know, dear. It was quite a good, uh, quite a good pull down. Anyway, that's it. Back in the old jalopy. Ready to go and pick up Mrs. Woman. I'm already running late. You know that. One more cast. One more cast. One more cast. <laughs> yeah, I was doing that. After, especially after I had that good bite, I was like, "Oh God, get another bait out. Get another bait out." But after that, just waiting. Anyway, right. I better get gone. Thanks for having a look. If you've had a look, if you haven't, why not? <laughs> anyway, sorted. Right, double thumbs up. Off we pop. See you in a bit.